Hey there, everyone. This is Alcal playing uh, Speed with Speed Zone. That's not true. It's Nermisa Land. I got speed on my mind because I just got done playing Sonic. Now we're going to take our time to gather stars and stuff. It's the rhythm of the universe has things. So here's four, here's three, here's five. We're going back in the mountains and we got a Tenchi. I think we can go on top of this cave. We're going to cover the cave. Yeah, we did it. We beat the cave. Cave arrow. Oh, hey. Bucket is back. Oh. Super ride is back. Uh. Then got Darren Time is back. Okay. <laughs> well. Tenshi, you were appreciated. That's a very awkward angle you got on your side art. It's kind of hard to read a little bit. So, all right. So we got a cave zone. So the idea here is that like you gotta keep it like real low so you can do this and go back. You know, that's all you need to do. Then you jump around and it's the revenge of a bucket. Except this time we are underground, not in the castle for everyone to love so at some point i need to go back in town what you didn't jump you and here you, you wanna what see here can go on the edge but here it's okay it falls way faster than you do so you can just do that and you're gonna be fine there might be an invisible wall in there there might be Oh man, do you need Tenchi power to be able to explore down here? It sure is being presented that way. Alright, well, noted. That's a bat. I jumped right into that bat. It was not... Oh, that's a pit? Difficulty picked up, it feels like. I guess you need to bounce on a bat to be able to make it? I don't know. Bucket for you, bucket for me, bucket for anyone that it pleases. Part of me is wondering if you can go inside a wall there, but it's a bit dangerous to check. So I want to have all my stars indicated before you know I start to take real risks like that. Yeah, so here, I think that you are expected to bounce on bats and miss the star. You know what? It's fine. You're gonna have to be re returning regardless. Yeah, so, uh, I'm feeling a remarkable increase in casual difficulty here. Alright, nothing there. That slow-moving bat is my friend. It's not really. It doesn't have a body. I don't befriend animals. I don't have... Well, I didn't... Stay there. Here we get a P-switch maze, because, of course, like, what else are we going to do? Uh, I just did that, and I don't know if I'm going to regret it. I don't know where I'm trying to go. Um, well, I'm going to jump, jump, jump. Yeah, okay. I'll take it. Get out of here, bat. <laughs> um... Alright, the, the, the P-Switch maze lasts a bit longer than I thought. Is that to say six? It sure is. Let me go into complete shock. So, uh... Alright, so... Bop! Bop! Yeah, there we go. Got that done now. Alright, so please don't panic, man. They only break when you step off. There you go, you did it. You beat the game. That's scary. That much is true. Oh, well... See, I wanted to be big because I thought that probably the power up. Mm, I don't know actually. Alright, so up until the end. There we go. Alright, so there's another star hidden somewhere. It's probably on the top half. Let's go check that out real quick. Uh, uh, yeah, uh. Busy body. Yeah, there we go. Busy moving. Alright, here we go. Yeah, dead video games. Uh, we... Well, well, we are riding a balloon until the end of time. Alright, I feel like it'll be simpler to just buy a couple of peaches out in the neighborhood and come back and go in that cave and see what up with that. That's what I'm thinking. Not exactly there. So, I'm, so it, you do get a peach here, so confirmed video games exist. Alright, so what's down here? A bunch of stars. Yeah, there's no red stars hidden among these. So you 
get you here. Oh wait, so there is something in there? Cause like, you know, like, there's a slow fade, right? Yeah! Oh, but you need to use this trampoline to get it. So there you go. All stars, you need to use this trampoline to get out of here, it looks like. Uh, do these turn around? Yeah, they do. Okay, well, it's making it nice and safe for me. I, uh, I, I still need to beat the level, though, which is, you know, not free. I'm pretty confident, but it's still not free, so... You know, we got this crazy place, where you, like, like, need to, like, do some enemy hopping with these physics. Yeah. <laughs> That's accurate. Oh, you didn't! Oh! Decisions were made with the composition of the song. Alright. Uh, I feel safer taking the top route, honestly. Then the back is gonna meet me. Oh, just, oh shoot. Uh... Okay, maybe I'm just gonna go out the actual exit here. Yeah! I completed a maze for real! I went out the end of the path of the maze and I said hello to the grandma who's kind of shaking a piece of glass. No one understands why. Stage six! Yeah, no, yeah, this is a marked increase in difficulty. We're outside in the field, there's just a girl here, girls there, girls everywhere. Can go inside a building and say hello. There's little froggies! Are these enemies? How are they enemies? They're cute little froggies! They're tiny! Oh, hey, I recognize... Whoa! Frog. Dang, how? how? Right, I still have... Well, okay, so I still have the ability to make yin yangs bounce everywhere and... So they jump when you jump? Okay, that's cool. Oh, there's a block here. Okay, well that makes it a lot more reasonable. Okay, well I got one of them. I'm trying to see if I can bounce a thing there. I'm not super confident about it. If I do that... You know what? Maybe I'll just come back for that one in particular. Or, if I go through the door, I bet that respawns things, yeah. So I have another chance at bouncing up the froggy. Yeah, so here it's actually real nice. So you do that, so that then you can... Hmm. If I'm in the air and I press the jump button, no. So there's something, but like, even on the floor, like, you bounce super high off of them. See, like, look at that. Ah, I don't know, man. Alright, you know what? That is my way of doing that. Wow, I just spent a lot of time doing absolutely nothing. Here we go! All these jugglers. This is dangerous. Y'all stop. Oh, the arrow wants me to go up. So naturally, that means I want to go in a building. Oh, jeez. This is haunting. Alright, I don't know why they decided to change direction, but I appreciate it. Thank you for this unlimited amount of points. Alright, you want me to bounce up, up there? I can do that. Here we go. Yeah, now we're in a different area. Oh, okay. <laughs> I got a bit uh, excited there. <laughs> but it's all good. I just did not notice it. Alright, so you want me to go there now, I can do uh, oh, doogie doogie dee do. Yeah. There we go. Best way to do that, as far as I'm aware. Alright, so, uh, I probably, so yeah, here I do want this. So this is like, hey, it's item progression, because, like, you can probably just scale the building and do it that way, but this is how you get things done, man. Then you can get this here, and you absolutely want to keep the carrot. Well, you don't absolutely want to, but they are going to be really useful uh, in the platform hops. Please don't smash my carrot. I don't want puree. I want the raw stuff. I guess you could eat raw puree. I wouldn't suggest it. In 
terms of taste, but like it wouldn't poison you or anything. Alright, here we go. Progress is made. Progress. Process that progress. Look at that. Uh, my ears turn around like they were the tails of a fox. That's how it works. More building. We're in the village. Oh boy. Alright. Hey, hey, see? Here we get the next power up stop in our world win four. The stone, the peach. I still want to use ears to cross here, but it feels like maybe the peaches are going to be relevant in this building. Let's look around this building first. Look at that. There's a roof. So I'm assuming that red kadam. Oh, I'm in the parade! Alright, I'm the bunny in the rabbit parade. There's always one of those. Okay. Yeah, he wants you to use peaches and cream here, somehow. And to give you a suwako, which I think is worrisome. I'll right, destroy that here. I don't know what I'm doing. But there's stuff to gather. And, oh, shoot. Well, now I can't really gather them anymore. Alright, well, I can't do anything here. Like, I can't, I cannot advance the plot. Alright, that's why, so I'm gonna have to return. I'm still gonna try and beat the level because, like, if I can beat it, that means I can rush through the early parts and not have to worry so much about the timer. Wow, just, oh, no, okay, so just go on top here, go on top of her, mess it up completely. I don't have a frogaloo, so yeah, I, I can't do anything. So you need to have both Tenchi and Frogaloo here to be able to progress into the flooded house, but alright, see? I still got, like, all up to here, but I still need to get all the items, though. So, my path will not change all that long. Okay, see, this bonus, very important. Uh, I might as well load my potion right now. I don't think I'm gonna need bunny ears anymore. Maybe I should get that just like right now. So like in case anything happens. Well I need both. Alright. Okay. Alright, so now I'm here. Let's be careful. Let's not do dumb things. As you know, as as exciting as it is to do dumb things. Oh wow, is this like a peach maze? Find my way through my maze, Superman! I did it. I found my way. Oh wow, so that is gonna go to the background. There's at least one more. I don't know if this is the best way to go at it. I don't think it is. Yeah, I need to get all the way there. Like, I think you go faster going like this. Sort of awkward diagonal. Alright, well you're dead. That's cool. Now my rock is just kind of stone there. It's pretty cool. Alright, I'm gonna go downward here. There we go. Yeah, I'm gonna keep going downward. Yeah, gotta put my weight into this. Oh, you're a jerk. Okay, uh, do I wanna go from below? Possibly. Dude, dude. Um, this could be also from above, right? Like, that's the thing. Oh, whoops. Well, I sure made this interesting. Alright, let's try to go from above. Okay, this might be the clue I needed. Or at least to force me into this path. Alright, I think that's both of them. And the other one's gonna be in the sewage. Like, my Yeah, see, there's nothing else here. Alright. Alright, gotta hurry though, a little bit. I'm a little afraid. Ah, uh, shoot. That guy, that girl, is there. No! Ah, and then I panicked! <sighs> well. Alright. The other one I got from the top, but I have to approach my angle. Oh wow, time is starting to run real low. Like, honestly, I might just get this and get the other one separate at this point because my time is real low. I know, please, Keystone. Alright, yeah, I'm just gonna get out and return for the last two. 
that's probably the smartest way to go. I can just like not kill her. God oh, damn it. Whatever. Whatever. I'll redo everything. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah, just digging through those. I I'm sure there's a more uh, efficient way to do it. I, I just don't know what it is. I'm assuming that I just need Suwako and uh, and the other four. Uh, I still need to get the whole progression though. But yeah, I, I, I'm pretty sure I just need Suwako and Tenshi for the last one. Also, yeah, this is an awkward spot. Yeah, the, okay, there we go. This is a lot simpler for me to get. Here we go, little red guy. All right, close is clear, and I got plenty of space. Yeah, yeah, you need to still have Tenshi to be able to make break this wall so you can go in the water. And then you're like, okay, that's not it. I'm gonna press this and open a door. So there's a red thing there. Um, oh. That's not what I wanted to do. So there's a secret exit? Okay. Can I just like go back in the door? Dang it! I didn't want to go in the secret exit! I thought it'd be like a bonus! Dang it! <laughs> I have to read the every... I got all the suits though, so if I can just do the platforming, maybe I don't need to attend everywhere. Hey! Oh wow, the best store in the world right here. It's really awkwardly situated. It's pretty good. Alright, I guess it makes sense. Alright, don't want to yet. This is as much as I'm gonna get. I'm not gonna save yet. I'm gonna I'm gonna finish what I sought out eventually, possibly. But yeah, now I got both forms that I need. So in theory, I don't need to return and get everything again. Kill her with my keystone. There we go. And wait for her to stop juggling. Yeah. I can just do this like normal platforming. Like, yeah, normal platforming. I didn't reach. Now I have to redo everything. So I guess you have to get. I'm sure you can do the jump there if you do it perfectly. Maybe from like super full spin. <laughs> I don't know if I need Suwako, actually. But probably. I mean, I guess you could try and kill all of these with keystones. Oh no! There's a current pushing you upward. Alright then, well. I didn't know that. I just assumed that if you're giving up free froggies, there must be a reason. That turns out, you never get free froggies for nothing. Ugh, how many times have I played through the entirety of the stage? I don't know, but I did it now. Look at that. I can slowly move for out of precision. Ugh, all right. Next, I mean, next time? Like, how much of the game is left? Is it just those two and the last extra? Is this the penultimate? Like, I feel it'd be pretty crazy if that was the case, but... I honestly don't know, man. 